Jedi, Jayo the Jedi here, and today we're going to be opening the Lego Minecraft, the farm cottage. And before we get into that, we have to shout out a winner that won a, a uh, contest, contest yeah. on Instagram. That's right. So we held another contest on our Instagram. You guys who aren't following us are missing out on some fun. So this time we decided to play a Guess That Jedi Master minifigure contest. I put a picture of Mace Windu and Evan Peel in an office on our Instagram. And I said whoever could guess the two Jedi names first would win a shout out in our next video. And they got to pick out which set we reviewed next. And the big winner is Gabriel's Universe. Please, guys, go subscribe to Gabriel's Universe yes, channel. Give, give him as much as love you give to us. That's right. On his channel, you will find book reviews, toy unboxings, vlogs, and so much more. Please, guys, go subscribe to him. His channel link will be in the description box below. Thank you so much, Gabriel, at Gabriel's Universe for playing our game on Instagram. Yes. All right, Geo the Jedi, I can barely see you. That box is so big. You well, look like a I'm tiny just, little guy. I'm just... Uh, <laughs> All right, are you ready to see what's inside? I've already t busted that tape open, man. Let's check it out. Uh-oh, here goes a big jump. Whoa. Hey, get back here. Stop you dropped them on the floor, didn't you? All right. Bag number one, instruction manual, whoa. That's big a big one. one. Bag number two. Whoa, there's two instruction oh. manuals. Bag number three, bag number four, and just. A little bit of stickers? Yeah, it's some uh, Let me see. Wow, guys, check these stickers out. I guess oh, we'll have to see I where see they it. go. I see it, it goes on the donkey, the name tag. Oh. Pretty cool. Max. All right, Max. guys. And this is the set that we got at the swap meet for only $30. We're so happy to get Lego scores. You guys know that. All right, Geo the Jedi, are you going to put this one together or are we going to do it as a tag team duo? Tag team duo. All right, tag in. You ready? Let's yes. do it. First, let's talk about these awesome minifigures and animals we got. Of course, you can't get a Lego Minecraft set without either getting Alex or Steve. And in this one, we got both. And good old Minecraft Steve is eating a cookie there Yum. and holding his, what do you call those things, Geo the Jedi? A wooden shovel. A wooden shovel. There you go. And next up, we've got good old Alex. And she is holding her... Pickaxe and some seeds. So That's she could right, guys. Dance. Check it out. This is a cool little detail that is new to us. We've never seen it before. It's depicting little seeds that she can plant. Pretty awesome. And of course, we've got a skeleton and his bow. And what we're really excited about, guys, is look at these animals that it came with. Yes. Look at this awesome donkey, guys. We've named him Max. He's equipped with a couple of saddlebags there to tote some vegetables around in the vegetable garden in the cottage that we're gonna show you in a minute. And I think he looks pretty darn awesome. This is our first donkey, right, Chill the Jedi? Yes. So we love you, cute little donkey. I love the build, I love how they made it. The only thing is, is you can't really have someone sit here while it has this piece on here. So or if you really want to get a minifigure to sit on there, you have to take that off. And next up, we've got the cute little pig that we've named Pixel. And it's a baby pig. That's why it's so darn tiny, but it's so darn cute. Cute little guy there. And only thing I wish is they would have given him a little curly tail there. Some sort of nice little tail would have been a cute detail that to add. That pig said that I want to get out of here, not into caught up some pork chop. Oh, we won't hurt you, pig. We will not use you for bacon, ham, or pork chops. Yes. <laughs> Good one, Geo the Jedi. And next up, we've got a mama bunny and, and a baby, baby bunny. bunny. And we have named the mama bunny Fluffy. 
cute little fluffy cottontail. Nice little rabbit there. I love these newer rabbit head molds that yeah. Lego has made. I believe they started making those in 2017 or possibly this year. I'm not exactly sure. But I do love the little baby bunny too. It's missing its little cotton tail also. But you know, it's such a tiny little build. I'm sure it was gonna be pretty hard to add a yeah. tail to those little animal guys there. But there they are guys. Cute little animals and the regular old Minecraft Alex and Steve and the skeleton. Now let's show you this awesome waterfront farm cottage. All right, before we get super up close in this and awesome waterside farm cottage, let's give you a quick little 360 tour of the entire build. Here, of course, is the backside of the build. Looks pretty cool, if I have to say so myself. Mm -hmm. And the front side. And the little side area here. And there we are, there, back to the front side. So now we will get in close and show you all the excellent and awesome details this thing has. Here is the awesome vegetable garden that this Minecraft set has crafting. So on the very left, we are growing some carrots and next is some wheat. And at the very end, we've got some beetroot. And I really, really love this, but those pesky bunnies keep trying to get into the vegetables yes. and they're eating it all up, aren't they, Geo the Jedi? Yes, Mommy Jedi. So Geo the Jedi, why don't you put that donkey there and show him, show us what you can put in those saddlebags. Check it out, guys. Look, there's a cool little holder that you could yeah, actually remove okay. the carrots and put them in the bag. Super awesome. I really love that detail that they have there with the removable carrots. And you can remove the other pieces pretty easily too, but they don't just slide in and out. They're actually pushed into those little Lego holes right there. So that is the cute little vegetable garden. And since we're on this side, why don't we look at the front door? Oh, there goes Mr. Donkey, but that's okay. We will pick him up in a minute. Let's get little fluffy mother rabbit out of the way. And here is our front door to the farm cottage. And it's got the same type of doors as um, the waterfall base had. Right, Geo the Jedi? Yep. And Geo the Jedi said this is a Minecraft map we have here in the front. Yes. And this is our Minecraft furnace. Uh -huh. Right, Geo the Jedi? Am I saying that right? Yes, so they could cook up some pork chops. Ooh, don't say that. Look oh. at it. Sorry, <gasps> Faye. Pixel here said, oink, oink. no, please don't. Eat me, I don't want to be a pork chop or a piece of bacon for breakfast. Poor little Pixel, you won't get eaten, I promise. So now that we're in Pixel's little cage here, check it out guys, it's just a cute little pig pen. I'm sure we can put our other animals in there too. Yeah. It actually has these working doors which yep. slide outwards, not inwards, Mommy Jedi. Did you guys see me try and push it inwards? So yes. That's how you get in on both sides and then it's got these closed off fences on the other side. So both sides of it actually does open. And I love this cute little flower detail they have growing off the water. Now onto this water side of this farm cottage. I really, really love that it's a water side cottage because who would not want to live in a cottage right next to the water? That would be amazing. We've got a cute little lily pad here. And Geo the Jedi, we should show them this working piece over here, which we have discovered is an anvil. So if you look closely, let's zoom in on that for you guys. We have got a chest with some little pieces on it. Why don't you show them those pieces, Geo the Jedi? So they are not printed tiles. These are where the stickers came from. So there it is there. We've got this piece that is supposed to depict a tile without a name yet. Now, Geo the Jedi, put it in that working anvil and let's show them how it works. So it's supposed to be a printing anvil. You put the tile in and you go boom, boom, boom. And then it's supposed to come out as one of 
these pieces with the actual name on it. So we had um, enough stickers with names on them for all the animals, and then there was a lot just like this where it didn't have names on it, which I thought was pretty cool because then it, we could pretend that we're naming it when we put it in the anvil and yes. it comes out. So I really like that that working piece right there that Lego decided to add into this farm cottage. What do you like about that part, Geo the Jedi? I really like that you could actually like put one of those tiles that are not printed, then just take it out yeah. quickly and just you swap can it pretend. With one. Yep, you can pretend. And who is up there in on the second floor? Skelly Boots, get uh, off! Oh, there. he better get out of there, or good old Minecraft Steve over here is gonna get him. Although he seems to be a little busy eating a cookie, yep. isn't he? Yep. Okay, so let's get into this section over here now. As you can see, we have removed the roof just so we can get in here pretty good for you guys. And this is the most disappointing part of this whole set. The one room that it comes with, all it's got is a crafting table and that little bunk bed. There is honestly nothing else to show in that room. I do like the window details that they have and the bricks. I think that does look pretty nice. Let's see, we do have some, you know, nice little window and brick detailing here. But other than that, that room does not have much going on in it. What do you have, think, Geo the Jedi? I think that when you wake up in the morning, you'll have a nice view of outside and the sun. That's true. Coming up. That's here. true. And you can walk right out here and look at the beautiful water, maybe do some fishing. So now that we have these modular pieces off, we can show you how this awesome thing can actually be easily rearranged. So you can see we just removed that from there. This was here, and I wanted to show you guys, we also have, what's inside there, Geo the Jedi? You're the one who knows what that stuff is. We got some is. hay. Ah, so Geo the Jedi said those are bales of hay. Let's take that skeleton out of there. Get out of there, Bones. We don't need you in there. Oh, ha, <laughs> he did a nose dive. Speaking of nose diving, guys, if you didn't notice before, so this was here. No, not that one. It turns this way. So it's kind of like a third floor, except for there's really no room for anything going on in there, except for maybe some animals. But look at this. It's a working diving board. Check it out. Ooh, right into the water, splash. I thought that that was pretty cool that they made a diving board right there. So let's remove all this stuff. You remember how it looked before. We are gonna make it so different. So check it out now, guys. I completely took this third story off from over here with the diving board. I put it down here where the pig pen was. I put the pig pen on the top and I simply put those roofs there. So now it's a one story little cottage here and we've got this awesome diving board here on this side to jump in the water, splash. And who's ever seen a pig pen on a roof? But I think that looks pretty cool. What do you think, Geo the Jedi? Yeah, actually I think I might keep it like that. It looks better. Like, do you like it like that? Yeah. You know, I think it looks pretty good like that too. So guys, these Minecraft sets, I will have to say I was never ever a fan of the ones before all these new 2018-2017 modular sets. I am now a fan. Minecraft and Lego, you guys have won me over. I truly enjoy these sets. I truly enjoy that you've gotten away from using all these big, humongous, chunky block pieces to depict everything in Minecraft. You now have better modular builds using better modular pieces, smaller tiles, smaller bricks. I absolutely love it. Geo the Jedi, any last words for your viewers on this set? Oink, oink. <laughs> the pig's just gonna hop over the fence, wait. Oh no, oh is the pig swimming now? <gasps> the pig took a nose dive into the water. Now the horse is gonna eat some hay. Hey, is that a horse? Wait, donkey's gonna eat some hay. Do donkeys eat hay? They probably do, right? Yeah. All right, so thank you everybody for watching our silly review on this yes. awesome farm cottage Minecraft yes. set. 
And don't forget to subscribe, hit that thumbs up button. Bye, peace out.